is really just to encourage the development of quality content, uh, which uh, reflect Namibian values, ideas, and uh, artistic creativity. I'll quickly just run through the minimum local content requirements. Uh, the very first one, uh, that's the only one that's applicable to radios, uh, either community or commercial, is that 15% uh, of the music that uh, they broadcast during a performance period must be local music. And that's the only requirement that's applicable to radio. We have had a lot of comments on that, especially from uh, NASCAM and other similar entities that uh, maybe we should increase that percentage to 50 or I'm sure they get uh, revenue from that also for the radios, the more local music are, are broadcasted. Tribe Fire Studios Chief Executive Officer Stefan Hugo and a participant who attended the stakeholders' engagement stated that the cost of producing local content is high and that stations do not receive enough advertising to buy local content. The majority of our content uh, at the moment, we are not buying content anymore. We are in revenue share agreements either with broadcasters or other content providers to share whatever revenue comes in. So and I think that is important um, concept to keep in mind. We constantly, when we get a lot of applications from local content people who all come stand at the door and expect us to buy at a thousand bucks a minute or whatever. And currently the commercial models just not, doesn't make uh, provision 